five reasons why I bought a Suron X over a KDM gasser. Number one is noise. Here I am at a motocross complex. It's a brilliant place, six or seven motocross tracks, enduro tracks. But I had to drive an hour and a half away because what's happening is the noise from bikes is pushing, pushing them out into far lying places and uh, you know the noise is not allowing tracks in urban areas as much anymore so riding is limited but on a Suron I can get up at 5 in the morning I can ride around my backyard my front yard out on the nature strip and no one cares so I can be out in the bush where bikes would, wouldn't normally be able to go I can meet a bushwalker stop and have a chit chat and no one complains it's different I think the reason why people don't like dirt bikes is not the dirt bike but it's the noise so electric bikes are going to open up a lot of opportunities in the future second reason is cost so this bike is approximately th a third the cost of a traditional um, traditional MX or enduro bike so that makes a lot of difference um, it allows more people to get into the market uh, more people to have the opportunity to have some fun so cost is a big thing and with the extra money you save you can spend a little bit on upgrading a few components or you can get a couple if you like the third thing is maintenance and reliability so the electric motor doesn't need any maintenance all you need to do is traditional things check your spokes check your chain charge the battery make sure everything's on staying on nice and tight but you don't have to strip any motors, no top ends, no rings, no bottom ends, no main bearings. So maintenance is a minimum and obviously that brings cost down as well. Fourth thing is fun. So you can have a lot of fun on these bikes. Just as much fun as a traditional dirt bike. You know, you can still pop your wheelies, you can do your, your front endos, you can ride through the scrub, do single track, you can do a little bit of motocross if you game. You know, so you can have a lot of fun on these things. And, you know, that's really important because we want to have fun. We buy these things to have fun. So the fifth thing, I think, is the upgradability. So because they're mostly mountain bike gear, the parts are very cheap. You can upgrade the suspension. You can upgrade um, protective gear. You can upgrade tires. You can upgrade batteries, controllers. So the upgradability allows you to get a lot more performance out of them if, if that's what you need, if you need that capability in the bike. A standard Suron is good for most people. Um, if you come from a, an MX bike to a Suron, okay, it will feel underpowered and feel a little bit small. If you come from a push bike up to a Suron, you probably think, wow, this has got a lot of performance. So it depends on what genre you've come from to start with. But overall, it's, um, it's a really quiet bike. Uh, it's it's a lot of it's really cheap cheap to run a lot of fun reliable and I recommend them so you know if you can get a ride on one grab one they're uh, really worth the money